Evening, hiya. Look kind of translucent tonight. Um, just jumped on to let you see the love warmer that um, I had mentioned whenever I was doing the how to remove your wax. And I've had a couple of people ask me about it. So this is the size of the box that comes in. Okay, it's one of our smaller warmers this way, but it warms the wax just um, the same as any of them from the minis right up through to the big ones. It's a really popular one. It's been around since I've started. Um, so I've been in it a couple of years now, but it's, it's one of the first warmers that I bought. It's still going strong in my bedroom. Um, this is the, the dish that it comes in, so you can see the colour of it. It's slightly off-white colour with this like taupey colour, almost grey, like taupey grey colour around the rim of it. It is an element warmer, which means it doesn't need any bulbs, um, which a lot of people like as well. It's, it's like nine centimetres, it sounds nine centimetres tall. Maybe this just fits on there. Okay. And it's got the love across with the, the colour surrounding it as well. It's a very, very popular we um oh, good message. It's a very, very popular wee warmer. It uh has quite a wide dish, you see here. It's quite a, a it's not overly deep, but it's quite a wide dish. So it does hold a couple of wee blocks. And because it's one of the older ones, it doesn't actually say on the back of it here um, how many cubes of wax to put in it. I usually put two. I put two in because it is quite wide and one is um, very narrow on it. Okay. Um, one tends to just be very, uh, not very deep in it, so I usually put two of the wee blocks of, is that, two of the wee cubes rather, of wax into it. it. It is wonderful. I mean, I say I got it. It was one of the first warmers that I've ever got. Um, and I absolutely love it. So it's £30. Pound. It's, as I say, nine centimetres high. It is the same as all of our waxes um, whenever they're warmed at low temperature. It um, doesn't give out any soot, no smoke, no flame. So from the safety point of view, it's very good. And also, of course, then the wax remains in it, the same as with all our warmers. The wax remains in it, so you don't get all of those up into the atmosphere um, from inside your house or in your bedroom or wherever. So mine's on, like, almost all the time. The only time I turn it is off is if I'm putting the diffuser on. And you don't have to do that, but I do. <laughs> so there you go. That's the love warmer. I'll post a couple of wee pictures up of it because it is, it is very cute. It is lovely. Um and it warms the wax just as good as any other one and I really really like it. I've had an awful lot of people buy it for Valentine's gifts for people, anniversary presents for people just because buying it for themselves like I did. Um, so if you want any more questions answered on it give me a wee shout. It at the back here I should just say the cable just plugs in and then it's a lead cable and then it plugs into your plug on the wall and then this sits on a side cabinet or bedside cabinet or living room, office, anywhere at all that you fancy. Some people have it in the kitchens and then there's just the wee button here. Press it off and on and there's a light. Um, it doesn't light up. It's not one of the ones that actually do have a light or a lamp in them. Uh, it is just the warmer side of it. But it's £30, 9 centimetres. doesn't take up an awful lot of space if you have limited space. Places like maybe bedside cabinets or whatever. Um, and it's very, very popular. So uh, thank you for asking for a wee bit more information on it. If there's any of the other products that we do that you would like a bit more information, do give me a wee shout because I love doing these. I love letting people see things when they're interested in them. And be good to each other and look after yourself. Thanks a million for watching. I'm away to do my quiz night now. Bye.